Amen. Amen. Victory and joy is our month theme. Wow, today is, I'm just somehow, okay, emotional. But I want to give God the thanks and praise. I just want to worship God because of what the Lord is doing for us in this ministry. Amen. 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 Our God is a good God. And it has never, it has not even started. We are just, we are just, uh, you know, uh, warming up. Amen. Amen. It has not even started because, wow, we're going to see great things. Amen. We're going to see great things. You know, one day I was praying and then, and then I had a voice of God and he says, um, I was asking God, when will my ministry start? When will my ministry start? And the Lord says, your ministry will start when you see the dead rising up. Amen. 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 That's what he said to me. He says, your ministry will start... Oh. When you see, when you pray for the dead, and the dead rise up. Amen. Amen. So that's why you now know I don't give up. If you call me and say to me, someone is dead, I don't believe he's dead. Amen. He's still alive. <laughs> he's still alive. He's still alive. <laughs> I don't believe it. I will continue to pray. Continue to pray. Continue to pray. Amen. 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 I will follow in prayer until go to, to, to go to the grave. I will still follow in prayer there. Amen. 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 <laughs> That's how stubborn I am in the spirit. I love that. <laughs> Amen. <laughs> Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise God. It's like, you know, this is like, um, you know, when someone is sick and someone is telling me, oh, it's up to death. It's, it's like, um, it, 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 there's a time I've been to coma. This, all these many of our brothers that are in coma. I, 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 if I call names, you will, I don't want to call names because um, it is so amazing. Amen. Amen. So I went to Koma and you, if you go to Koma, I tell you, 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 when you come out, you, say, you ask yourself, what is this life? What is this life? Everything you have, you forget about it. You no longer, you just only, the, only through the help of the oxygen. Everything all, all over you, and then you come out and say, "What is this? What am I struggling for? What am I arguing for? What am I fighting for?" Mm. Amen. Amen. But I thank God, I have got a lot of people that are in coma, and they all come around. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 They come around. Amen. Some of them are alive, and some of them have come around and died. Amen. Amen. But the most important thing is that they come around. Amen. Amen. God saved. Amen. Amen. God, saved. Amen. God is Amen. a good God. God is a faithful and a just God. So God is good. So you know now that you, you don't have a pastor that give up. I, I'll continue to pray. I know that a lot of times. Amen. <laughs> <laughs> praise, praise, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. Our God is good. So now we have this wonderful message. It says, uh, we, this very month we have captioned our, our theme of the month to be victory and joy and last uh, week friday we have introduced this message and we said that um, um when you overcome or uh, the overcome an enemy then you are successful okay victory is when you overcome your enemy and then you are successful that is a victory that like, say a victory match like after the the first world war the second world war there's always a victory match. I'm just saying the big victories. Amen. Mm. And then, you see, I, I also victory is an achievement of um, mysteries or success in, in a struggle. When you struggle like someone that has been in coma and you pray that person out of the coma, mm. that is a victory. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Or someone that Amen. is dead. And then, by the, by the power of God, you pray, and that person, the dead person, raise up. Amen. 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 That is a victory. Or, or like this, our sister, our sister Rihanna, in, in Jamaica. And what I want you to know, there's no distance in the spirit. Amen. What devil need to hear is the word. The word is Jesus. He said, I send the word. The word that is sent is Jesus. Jesus, go straight. Say, go, go. Amen. Amen. <laughs> Good password. <laughs> I want you to understand. I want you to understand that Jesus Christ said, "Look, don't look at me as a king. Don't look at me as I'm here for you for you to serve me. I am here to serve eh, you. you." Therefore, Jesus is still serving us. Hallelujah. When He said, "Jesus, go, go, He will go." go. go. Yeah. 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 Amen. 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 Amen.
God. So he is still serving us. When he said to him, Jesus, go to Jamaica, go to Nigeria, go to America, go to Europe, go to wherever, go and walk, go and deliver, go and set people free. Yes, he will go. He's still at work. He's still at work. Amen. He, he didn't go to heaven and say, oh, I'm the king now, you're going to come and bow down before you're going to serve me. Yeah. No, he is still humble. Yeah. He is Amen. still serving you yeah. and me. Amen. 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 Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Jesus is still serving us. He's still helping us. That's why he said he's the mediator. Okay? He stands at the middle. He's, he's answering our prayer. You, you bring your prayer. He said, God, now you, you got to do something. You, you got to do something. This is my son. This is my daughter. He's bringing this request. You got to do something. That's my name. You know, he knows. He, he, he's, he's, he's calling my name. And Amen. God said to him, oh, yeah, take it. Then you take it from God. And then he will bring it to us. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. <laughs> Glory be to God. <laughs> Jesus is Lord. Amen. So when you achieve something, when you, are, when you get achievement from your struggle, and then that is a, a wonderful um, victory. And you say joy, joy, uh, joy is a feeling of pleasure or happiness that comes from success. You know, when you have success, like this wonderful family that I've got to in now, joy has come. Hallelujah. Amen. Joy has come to them. Amen. That is joy. And look at the struggle. The struggle is that the mother was scared. The, 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 the nine months pregnancy. Actually, she was the five, labor, months, five months. Five months. Five months. And look, and the labor and everything that is in it. That's the five struggle. Months. She's five months now? She's, she, she was. Her she was, but now she's delivered. She's baby's out. So, so the baby is in the incubator now. The baby is alive. It's alive. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna get the full, we're gonna get a full picture. We're gonna, gonna get a full, full picture. We're gonna get a picture of those wonderful baby. We're gonna get everything, and we're gonna bring it over here. Amen. Amen. So our God is a very good God, and then that is the victory. Okay, like a, a, a woman that is um, in labor. He, she labored and labored. And look, women, sometimes you think it's only you that laboring. Sometimes we men will labor more than you people. <laughs> 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 let, let the men say, Amen. Let the men say, Amen. Let the men say, Amen. Amen. I tell you, sometimes we, we, we suffer. Eat. We suffer more than you. <laughs> we suffer <laughs> more than you. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> no comments. Yeah. No comments. No comments. Yeah. Yeah. No comments. <laughs> we thank God for the ladies. Anyway, we thank God for our mothers. What can we do? Can't what can we do without our mothers? We wouldn't be here in the first place. <laughs> <laughs> that's why. I, that's why I, I refuse. I say, God, you're not taking my mother anywhere. And then, the only thing that been, the, the only thing that stopped the prayer that that fire is come. I will show you where she is. Uh, Amen. Stop that You know, you know that you can, you can, you know, like like the widow. You know the widow. He said they, they, they went to unjust judge. He was nagging, nagging. That is what yeah. is called intercessory prayer. He was nagging every day. You stay at the you, the, the judge will stay at the window, and then she will say. Vindicate me! You can do it! <laughs> Amen! <laughs> God is Lord! <laughs> That's what it's done. Amen! Say, you can do it! Look at me! They are coming to take me too! You can do it! Save me! Yeah, and the judge, true. after a long time, the judge said, Oh, this woman is one of those. Let me just do something and just go and have rest. <laughs> Amen. 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 That is the way you approach God. That's the way you're going to pray, and God will say, "Wow, I'm gonna do something so that I will look. I will look somewhere else because you don't, you don't allow God to look somewhere else. Every time it's attention. Knock on the door. Knock on the door. And God will say, "Oh, you know, I'm gonna do something so that I'm gonna look somewhere else. I'm gonna." Take care of other people. Amen. Amen. <laughs> Praise God. Hallelujah. You know, I will tell this story. Stop this, watching this, me. This is a very good story. It's like when we, uh, when my children are little, okay, they went and bought something. Went and bought something, come back home. And then we are, we are trying to, 
you know, to, to share it. Mm. We are trying to share it. This is my son here that's, that's what we call peace. She was, he was rushing. Give me my own. Give me my own. <laughs> and I said, cool down. <laughs> when we share it, then we know which one is. He said, no. You want to give it to me now? One piece. And then he, he said, <laughs> You know what he said? He used to say, Daddy, if you give it to me now, I'm cool. I'll just go and sit down. <laughs> <laughs> and I said, oh yeah, take your own. I, I said, take your own. The day, day I give it to him, he just went and sit down on the floor and he was eating it. And I said, I've got peace. It's peace rain. Amen. Amen. <laughs> so, if we can be like one. that to our God, knocking at the door, banging, banging you gotta open because it. Because you told us to do that some, some. Yes. <laughs> God, you gotta open it. God is gonna give to us and say, okay, go and sit down now and eat it, okay? So let me look at the, the, the grown ups now. Go and sit down and take your bread and eat it. That's yours, okay? And then he said, mm, thank you. Mm, thank you. Amen. 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 God is a good God. Amen. 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 So God is good. That God is good. Amen. I just wanna thank God. Just approach God as a child. A, a, a child approaches dad. You, okay, just see God as a dad, and you you know nothing because we know nothing. Just go there and say, disturb him, he's sleeping, waking up, and wherever he's going, follow him, hang on. Daddy, you know you got to do it. Daddy, you know I need this. Daddy, you know I need to get it. Daddy, you know I need to get it. Amen. Can I ask something? Then, yes. Mm -hmm. You know, this lady that called me, she, yeah. you know, the first thing she told me, yeah. uh, the, she had the baby out of wedlock. I said, I'm not interested in that. Amen. <laughs> she had the baby out of, out of wedlock. wedlock. I said, I'm not interested. The baby have to leave. Let me collect my pastor yes. first. <laughs> <laughs> the most important thing is for the baby to leave, live, the life to come. And that baby, you've already done it. When you've already done it, why will you kill yourself? Yeah. It's already done. Yeah. All you need to do now is to amend. Do you understand what That's I mean? That's why she, she said she gave her life to Christ. Yes. Yeah. So now, look at what's happening now. It says, I am mentally coming back, back to, Christ. to Christ. Amen. That's what so God Did she say that first and then the babies were alive? Or she the babies were alive and then she said? The baby were alive, then she said. Oh, okay. Yeah. So she see the miracle. Yeah. Oh, okay. She see this godly signs. Yeah. And then she said, mentally, I am coming back to Christ. Amen. 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 So yeah. there's no need for us to judge. We don't judge. Yeah. For me... I don't want it to happen at all. Mm. Don't let it happen. Mm. It's not good. Don't let it happen. Mm. But when it happens, what are you going to do? Are you going to kill somebody? Don't You're not going to kill yourself? Baby. Amen? Try to abort the You're gonna, baby. No. no. If, you are, if you commit abortion, that means it is, it's a sin with a scar. It will never go out. Mm. Every time you go out, you will remember you killed somebody. You do not know whom you have killed. Abortion is zero. zero. Don't even think of that. Don't come to your mind. Don't let it not come to your mind. Abortion is zero tolerance. Amen. 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 Our God is good. Okay. So now today, um, I think we've, we've got a lot, of, a lot, a lot of message. But I'm going to ca cap it like five minutes, and then we save it for next week. I'll save it for next week. <laughs> Amen. <laughs> so we have got enough. We've got enough. Yeah. yeah okay. Our God. Our God is a good God. So, but next week, we're going to have a message on victory. That's conquer for victory. Amen. Conquer for victory. victory. Amen. Amen. Conquer for victory. victory. So, I'm going to introduce it a little bit. And it says, victory comes when we are successful. And success comes from battle hmm. or war or fight. Hmm. Amen? Amen. Amen. Victory comes... When we are successful, mm -hmm. and success comes from a battle, from war, from fight, amen. amen. And then that's why now God position us. He said, "Take the position." He said, "God, what position?" He said, "You gotta take the position to fight this battle." God, what the position? He said, "You gotta fight it by faith." Amen. 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 So you gotta take this position. Get your sword. Get get your, get get ready. <laughs> you gotta fight this battle. And he said, God, how can I fight this battle? You're going to do it. He said, no, you do it. He said, how can I do it? Lord said, it's going to be by faith. Amen. Amen. So the Bible says, if you read 1 Corinthians chapter, uh, first, uh, 2 Timothy chapter 4 from verse 70, it says, Apostle Paul says, I have fought a good fight. I have finished my course. I have kept the, uh, I have kept the faith. He says, I have fought a good fight. I have finished the course. 
I have kept the faith. I'm going to summarize there. I have fight a good fight. I have. We don't go and start to shoot people and kill people to get out of our way. That is, that is, that is not what God wants us to do. What God wants us to do is to win that battle on our knees. To win the battle on our knees. The Bible said, strengthen your weak hands and your, and your knees. Strengthen it. That battle that is raging, that war that is raging, is the battle of faith. We're going to win the battle by faith. We're going to win the battle by talking to the master. By talking to the master, say, God, Amen. Jesus, Amen. I believe in Amen. you. I know you are ever. You are ever. If we can connect with him and say, God, I know you are doing it. You are able. You are able. Don't give up. Insist. Stay there. Knock at the door. Don't give him rest. Don't give God rest. Remember what Jesus Christ said. Look, I am telling you, my children, when I will come back, when Jesus will come back, will he find faith? He says, none of you have even come with that full faith. I won't see the full flame of faith. He says, even if Abraham... Abraham did not even come to with the full flame of faith because he stopped when he said, God, what about five? If you see five, will it destroy Sodom and Gomorrah? Abraham stopped there. He didn't come with the full flame of faith. He says, you, up till now, you've asked nothing. That's what the Bible says. Up till now, you've asked nothing. Ask and it shall be given to you. So that your joy may be full. He said, ask and they shall be given to you so that your joy may be full. Up till now, you have asked nothing. Ask and it shall be given to you so that your joy may be full. And that is our topic for this very wonderful month of February. Victory and joy. Can somebody shout a big hallelujah? Hallelujah. 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 hallelujah.